Hi everyone, my name is Danny. I'm a no-code consultant here at SMV Virtual Consulting where we help you navigate no-code solutions out in the real world. Today I'm excited to share with you a brand new feature released by Airtable that enables you to share interfaces publicly. So whether you're in education, business, or any other field, this new feature makes your life a whole lot easier by enabling seamless sharing with external users. Let's dive right in. I have a sample of an education database right here and I'm gonna use it to show you the new feature. So we're gonna go over here and we're gonna click out of the data portion and we're gonna move over to interfaces. And as you can see, we already have an interface built out. Well, what I wanna do is I wanna share with the district all the students associated with Oak Hill Elementary. So I can do that by going ahead and adding another page, click add page, we're gonna make this be a list, and then we're gonna hit next. And then I wanna make a list of the students, perfect. And now we're gonna hit finish, and it brings us to this page. Next, we're gonna customize this page and make sure it displays all the information that we wanna share out and organize the data. So I am going to go ahead and make this shorter so we can see everything. We can go ahead and hide this field since we already have the full name right here. And let's go ahead and add in date of birth and grade. Perfect. And make this a little bit shorter. Awesome. Now let's go ahead and create a filter. Go down over here to filters and click on it and then go ahead and configure page level filter. Click on it again and where schools has any of the, we'll pick the school. Oak Hill Elementary is what we wanna pull and awesome and see how it filters all the information and these are all of the students at the school Oak Hill Elementary. All right, let's go ahead and label our new page that we created. So go here in the upper left hand corner, click on pages to display all the interface pages and we are gonna rename this. We're gonna rename it the school Oak Hill Elementary. Perfect. And then we're gonna go over here and hit publish. Okay, publish. Now let's finally go over this brand new feature on how to share your interface publicly. So in order to do that, we're gonna go over here to share. We're gonna click share right here. And you can see we have share publicly right here. And this is, you toggle this section on right here, the share selected page publicly. This will be read only. So the people that are able to view this either on a website or when you share the link can only read it. They cannot adjust any data. So you toggle this on, enable public sharing. And then you can even go in here to link settings and you can control who can access this page. Anyone on the web, anyone at the domain, you can even um, require a password right here and you can allow users to navigate the full app right here by toggling this on. However, they do have to have an Airtable account in order to have this. We'll leave that not toggled on. Let's click out of this. And so you can copy the link right here by clicking that. And here's the link right here. And then, or you can do an embedded code. So you click embedded right there and it brings you to this code and you can put this on a portal. You can put this on a website, wherever you think that you would need this embedded code, you can put it right here. And then also you have a desktop version and a mobile version as well. And that's it. This new feature on Airtable is a game changer for sharing specific interfaces with external users securely and efficiently. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more no code solutions and tips. Remember at SMB Virtual Consulting, we help you navigate no code solutions out in the real world. For more information, we have links to our website and to schedule a discovery call below. Stay tuned for more exciting updates and until then, happy creating.